to Vlogmas, day three. That was confusing because it's the second, but it's the third day. You see how that can confuse me, honey? Yeah. <laughs> and um, I have some eye patches on, obviously. I, I just, I realized the other day, I got these ones in the Fat Fit Fun winter box, and I haven't been using them, so I'm trying to use them. Um, anyway, this is, we ended up getting... What do you think? Three inches, maybe, honey? Yeah, not not as much as we thought we would end up getting it the way it was coming down last night. Um, but then it's been really windy, so you can see there's not much on the roof over there and stuff. But then apparently it's going to rain. I, I don't know. It's 34 degrees, so it's kind of right on the edge. Um, I was going to show you this. This I put the I put Chris's scarf in here. So I just kind of rolled it up and stuck it in there. I just want to stick a little something the rest of there. So when I figure that out, I'll show you. Hopefully. Maybe not. I don't know. She may she may get it before I get to show you guys. So I, it's funny. I already poured my first um, cup of coffee. And without even thinking, I didn't do one of my 12 days of coffee. So let me stick you guys in the cupboard for a minute here. Um, maybe. There, stick you guys in the cupboard. And I'm going to open this up. And this is the one that apparently it looks like this. And you can get this at, people have seen it at Big Lots, I've heard, Hobby Lobby. And I ordered mine on Amazon. So we're just going to go with, let's see, let's do candy cane coffee. This French roast, I don't think I'm going to love that one so much, but... Maybe I'll have that tomorrow. So I'm going to set this up here, over here. And, uh, yeah, so it's 7.20. I'm not sure if I showed you guys that. And we are getting ready for church, obviously. I am not going to sing today. I would say most of my pain is right here today. Um, really kind of in that lower left hand. So, again, I think I've said this before. I don't know if that's where they had the issue um, you know, where they said they had one that gave them a harder time. I don't know if that was the one or not, but I would suspect that it is. Um, I'm going to try to not take any, oops, I got to add water. I'm going to try to not take any pain pills today, like Advil, I mean. I've only taken one, I think I told you guys that, of the Vicodin. I just don't like how it makes me feel. So I had to close you guys in the cupboard. <laughs> so I could get in here to do the, into the water into the water. Fill the water. Seriously, Kristen. Then there was some spillage. You know, it's never simple. Um, anyway. Try not to take any ibuprofen today since I'm technically not supposed to take it anyway. Um, there's no point in taking Tylenol because it does nothing. <laughs> For me anyway. So, yeah. Today is going to be relatively low-key. I may have overdone it a little bit yesterday, and so I'm going to try to we'll go to church, I'm going to make a grocery list and run to the grocery store, Packers are on at noon, <clears throat> that's about it really, I need to make, kind of just make some lists today, so I don't know, I don't know, I've had people um, direct message me asking me for, um, oh hi, look at this one. So, right, are you going to go use your new snowblower, or is it not enough? I don't know. I got a little. <laughs> I will listen to see if I hear the snowblower. So, if you guys, for those of you that haven't been watching our vlog for very long, first of all, welcome. Second of all, in April, we had three feet of snow in how many hours, really? 24 hours, really? Yeah, I guess it was about Friday night and sun, yeah. So... <clears throat> 36, 48 hours. Anyway, <laughs> it was a lot of snow. And the snowblower, our old one that we'd had for our whole marriage, pretty much, I think, um, died. And <laughs> in the midst of the snow. Anyway, so we just bought a new snowblower. And so I said to him last night, I'm like, are you excited to use the snowblower? He's like, uh, kind of. <laughs> So, oh, what I was saying, direct messaging. <clears throat> I've had some people direct message me asking me, like, if I could show how I do my, 
like holiday prep, like how I get stuff done and blah, blah, blah. blah. So I'll try, I guess. I'm not, I'm not really sure. I, I feel like ours is so much different because we don't have a lot of people that we buy gifts for. <clears throat> Excuse me, gifts for. We do gift cards and the ornaments and stuff. And I kind of showed you some of that in yesterday's vlog. Let's see how this tastes. Oh, I can smell the mint. Mm. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I don't think I like mint coffee enough to buy a whole, like, box of it. But I like it enough to have one here and there. <clears throat> anyway. So I'll show you the husband. Like, today I'm, what I plan on doing is making some lists. I want to make lists of, um, like, who I'm sending toffee to. And I hear the shovel, which means it's not, not enough snow for the snowblower. Um, list of who I'm sending toffee to and uh, um, like things I need to buy, like the little tins I need to buy and that sort of thing. So I'm going to work on some lists today and I'm, I'm just going to try to do little things each day this season, especially since I've ended up not having to travel this week so that I don't have to like run around like a crazy person at any point in the season. We'll see how this works. Okay guys, I was wrong. All of a sudden I was putting on my foundation I was like, he's got the snowblower out. Oof. It smells like it's burning oil or something. Must just be the new smell. But anyway, in case you've never seen a snowblower, <laughs> that's a man, some golden snow. And it's, um, it's pretty icy. So, um, he doesn't seem to be too, ha too happy about it currently. I don't know. Alright, it's about 8.30. I thought I would show you guys my outfit of the day. <laughs> These boots, I love them and don't all at the same time. So, let me turn this light on. I got them at Torrid last year. Online only because they're actually suede in the front and they're like elastic-y kind of in the back. I don't know. Anyway, but they're so big. I, I got them in a 10 wide. And they're just really big. I, I originally got them because... Um, I thought, well, I'll wear them with bulkier socks, but I don't have any bulkier socks. Anyway, I like how they look. I just don't like how they fit so much. But anyway, so I don't know if you can tell or not, but they are a really cute riding boot. They have a little bit of a difference. So it's way in the front and then that material in the back. And there's a, see the line that comes up the back. And I like how they look. They come up a little bit taller than my other riding boots. But they're just, there's just like a lot of extra space. So they're not the most comfortable boot. But it's just for church. It'll be fine. And then these are those yummy leggings. This is a shirt actually from Amazon that I think I showed you guys these. My friend Wilson bought a bunch of them. Didn't like any of them, so I just bought them from her. There's a little ruching here that you can't see. But I like that it makes it fitted here and not so loosey-goosey. You know what I'm saying? And... Uh, um trying to remember. I don't remember where I got this, but I got it a long time ago, so I'm sure you wouldn't be able to locate it anymore. Anyway, necklace. One of them is, this one is the HRH collection, and then this one is Alexis Batar, and then these earrings were a gift from a subscriber a couple years ago. Her name is Whitney. Bracelets, HRH collection as well. So that's that, and on my face today, um, Seriously, I, I almost feel like I'm walking funny in these boots. I'm just going to have to figure, you know what I need to do? I know what I need to do. There are those insoles that are fluffy boot insoles. If I get a pair of those in here, then that'll take up more space and they'll fit better. That's what I need to do. Um, oh, here. On my eyes, I've been playing with this that came in the November Boxy Charm. It's the Ace Beauty Grandiose palette. Um, so I have those shades on my eyes. So I'll show you guys what this looks like. If I can flip it up in here. Um, so yeah. And then my lip today is MAC Velvet Teddy with Skinny Dip, Jouer Skinny Dip over the top of it. And I use Boldly Bear as a liner. Warm sole on my cheeks. So that's that. Alright, I'm going to take my chipmunk cheeks. <laughs> We're going to head off to church. Oh, we got to ask Bobby how the snowblower situation went. All right, snowblower, day one. What about it? What did you think? 
I ain't got to get some chains to put on it. And one wheel turn, one wheel, only one wheel is self propelled, huh? Which apparently. It blew up good though. Yeah, what did you say it blew, what, before when you were telling me? It blew it clear into the, I can't remember what he said. Halfway across the front yard. Yes. So he's happy about that. So I'm going to go uh, throw a tie on him. And we're going to pack our stuff up and we're going to head over to church. So we will see you a little bit later. All right, you guys. I'm heading into the two minute warning of the Packer game. It's about three o'clock. It's tied up currently, right? Yep. Um, and I am just, so I am just, first of all, I have to tell you, I got the biggest surprise of my life. Stephen was, <laughs> maybe not of my life, but Stephen was supposed to have gone back to Germany yesterday and he surprised me. He's actually going to be in town for a month before he starts a new job in January. So he, I heard the door, I was sitting on the couch answering comments and Bob was outside having a stogie. And all of a sudden I heard, <clears throat> and I was like, not paying attention. I figured it was just Bob clearing the throat. And then I heard it again and I turned, I was like, what? And it was Steven. So we had a really nice visit. Um, and he is, you know, off to do some things now. So, so many of you said, what do you mean the, the get the, the spots out of your table trick? So I'm going to show you guys. I saw that somewhere on, I don't even know, eons ago on um, YouTube. And so all you really need is a towel. It's supposed to be white for some reason. I don't know why. And boy, I got to tell you, I really think it's time for a new vlog camera because it doesn't really want to focus on anything. Anyway, so you can see these spots here. So you just put a towel over it. I, I, I don't know how to do this one handed. Hold on. Okay, and I have, I honestly can't do this one handed. Um, I'm going to try, but I don't think I can. And you have to have steam. I don't even know where the spot was now. But you just have to make sure that you have steam. I don't know why, but you do. And you just go over the spot, and it comes out. You have to do it usually a couple of times, but see how it just comes right out. I'll show you a couple more here, but let me finish this one up. Um, and one of these spots, I gotta move my thing down here. One of these spots is actually for your nail polish remover from <laughs> when the girls were over. <laughs> so that won't come out. I think it's, I think it's one of those spots, but anyway, so again, I'm trying to get you guys good lighting. So you just put the towel over the spots. You can see those two spots. And try to, I'm trying to do this one handed. You just have to go over it. Good amount, make sure you have steam. The steam for some reason makes a difference. And then you just keep checking it. And there you go. It's all gone. Presto changeo. This one needs a little more time right here. So you just keep doing it. I just do it, you know, slow little motions. I took out that one. Spend a little more time on this one. Just the, I'm telling you, the steam is the key for some reason. So you have to make sure that you have it on your steam setting. So I had to pause to watch the Cardinals kick their field goal. And there you go. So you can see those spots are out. I'm going to just work my way around to get the other spot. Oh, seriously. With the focusing situation here. Um, there you go. See, that's all gone. All right, so I have to say, it even helped a little bit with the, the nail polish remover stain. Just wipe it down the rest of this to make sure I'm not missing any spots here. I would use probably a little bit more, but there you go. As you can see, no more white spots. So that, my friends, is the uh, iron towel remove white marks trick that I learned somewhere on the internet.
Thank you.